The sub today could not control the kindergarten class and it was absolute pandemonium. Pandemonium. Wild and noisy disorder, right? It means chaos, confusion, and uproar. But it hasn't always. Has it gotten worse and worse over time? No, it used to be way more intense. Let's trace it back to its dark beginnings. In 1901, the Contemporary Review wrote, rather judgmentally, those slums have become a pandemonium of drunkenness and social evil. Because back then, pandemonium more often meant the place of chaos rather than chaos itself. And a place of chaos with distinct overtones of evil, a place of iniquitous confusion. Why this connotation? Because even earlier, it was used to represent hell. An 1854 poem reads, The peerage of pandemonium stood mute in expectation of Satan's voice. And in Frankenstein, Shelley writes, It presented to me then as exquisite and divine a retreat as pandemonium appeared to the demons of hell. So what was pandemonium that it should represent Satan's domain to these writers? Well, they were familiar with John Milton. And in Paradise Lost, he had invented the word pandemonium by combining pan, meaning all, with daemonium, meaning demon. All the demons. He wrote of a solemn council forthwith to be held at Pandemonium, the high capital of Satan and his peers. Pandemonium is the capital city of hell. And that's why, perfectly reasonably, we use it to describe unmanaged kindergarten classes. Anyway, thanks for watching. Let me know what we should talk about next. And as always, come along if you feel like it.